ladies and gentlemen, please your next fighter for the ring. Put your hands together for Mohammed Alfalski in the blue corner. Mohamed Al C. Opens to the PFA ring, fighting at the blue corner. 156 pounds, 2 and 0 out of Siege MMA. Very good to Siege MMA. I know a couple guys who train over there. They, they always do a good job of prepping their guys to fight. Yeah, I've seen a couple of his last fights. He seems to uh, have that Muay Thai heavy stance with a kick in that leg. Uh, up with the one, two, the leg kick. It's, uh, seems like it's something he uses quite often. He's quite comfortable with that leg kick. So I think we're probably going to see a few of those being chucked tonight. But as I always see, just keep it simple. You don't need to be showy. You don't need to be flashy. Just keep it simple. One, two, leg kick. It works. It works wonders. Well, how about you? <laughs> You know, we all kind of learn the lessons that Ernesto Roos taught everybody. Yep. You know, simplicity wins, simplicity wins. You can do it really well. And you know, straight good solid mm -hmm. punches with a good neck kick. You do a lot of sport. Ladies and gentlemen, help me welcome his opponent. Raylan Peterson. The world world. So here we got the one and only Ray Cold, Raylan Peterson walking towards our own. So Raylan made weight yesterday at 156.2 pounds. He's 2 and 0 as well. He comes off a horrendous knockout, which he got with his last win. 14 seconds that knockout in the first round, and that included the 10 count. It was a teep and a right cross. I've trained with Ray now for about a year and a half, and I haven't been hit by anyone harder than Ray. His hands are dynamite. His first first win was uh, stoppage. Second win was KO. They didn't go past 14 seconds. And I haven't met a nicer guy. He is a fucking tremendous bloke. He's calm, collective. And if you ever watch him at face-offs, I haven't seen him have a face-off yet where he hasn't laughed. <laughs> he just enjoys his sport a lot. So. I think he's got a little bit of a reach advantage here in terms of height. I think he's a couple of inches higher. of 156.8 pounds. Heidi, out of siege MMA. In Peoria, Arizona, he traduces Muhammad His opponent fighting out of the ring. He wins and no losses. The 156.8 pounds fighting out of Ethan. From my gym as well. What a player. Presenting Ray Lynn, Ray Cole Peterson. We got two really good camps sending their undefeated products to each other right now. Both fighters do it up. One's going to get that first last time. immediately with the long hands. Southpaw versus Orthodox once again. Leg kick's coming. Both fighters are looking quite relaxed in there. And calm and collective. Good hands by Ray coming in fast. 
Nice little dodge there from that inside kick. My body. He's missing it. Yep. 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 Those hands are quick. You know, nice little lean back there as well to get out of range. Yep. Nice. Oh, hey. Yeah, his timing on getting out of the distance is good. The pass is thrown well. Oh, Mo landed hard shot. Yep. Yeah. If I was Muhammad, I'd get on this. Innocent, yep. Innocent, yep. I think he's noticed that already. He's cutting that distance down. Yeah, Mo, Mo, I think Mo's realized that. He's cut the, he's realizing he's got to walk him down. Some good kicks were landed there, definitely. And some very nice, elusive movement to move out of the way just enough. Peterson is he's using his reach so well, it's almost like he didn't have to check. It's like he wasn't checking. He was just using that little kick out to avoid the kicks. It yeah. really feel like he had to stand there and get it. And still managed, I think, to control most of the ring. Yep. We have to give a little thank you. One of the O's has got to go. Let's see what changes have been made after that. That's a nice break. That's a nice check there. Clear instructions coming from both corners here. First kick, Peterson is checked. Yep. Boy. Yeah, Ray's, Ray's moving vertically back. Oh, he got a checked hook there. That was, that was a good hook here. Uh, how fast he landed. Yep. Muhammad answers. Yep. Muhammad's hands are looking good, actually. They're up close to his chin. He's protecting himself. Mm. Oh, Stiff job, yep. Yep. Mm. In and out. That was nice. Very nice. Yep. Yep. Muhammad's hands are nice and high. They're keeping it protected as well. And he's... I think Mo's maybe landed a few, couple more shots in this, in this round. Head open. Good round. Hard one to call that. Hard round to call. Both fighters landed good punches. It looks it looks as though Mohammed is not trying to engage in the kicking game. His yep. kicks, he, like, if we're watching some of his kicks, he's not putting power on any of his kicks. He's yep. almost using them as like a range. Yep, agreed. I think he's realized his hands, he needs to get in there. 
he's cut that distance down a bit more, especially with that one. I think Mo's also chucking maybe a, a few more hands this round as well compared to the first round. So, you could... I, I really like Peterson's head movement, but he needs to find opportunities to counter. Yeah. After, he, after he's avoiding, he's very loose. He's doing a great job. But I'd like to see him find places to add offense after he, after he counters and things like that. I like some offense. Yeah. Let's go, Ray. So, I think I think it's probably one of one at the moment. So, this last round will be the decider. Yep. Yep. Oh, nice hands being landed. Yeah. Very, very good exchange. I wonder if he has his leg or something, maybe in one of the checks. I don't know. Like, or is he just having more success with his hands? Oh, that, yeah. And again. Leg kick, yep. Yep. Oh, slip. Again, that's working for him. Yep. Both of them are landing. Oh, uppercut, big uppercut. Oh, it's good. Yep. And a left hand. Yeah, far and back. Hey, the crowd. Look at that. Both of them have got tough chins. Yeah. Yeah. I think Ray looks kind of stunned. He looks oh, yeah. 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 yeah, this is going to be up. A... That was a good fight. That was a cracking fight. Third round for Muhammad Al Yeah. Yeah, it was landing. I think that was the most effective shot of the entire fight. Yeah. Muhammad's straight left. Mo's face is, uh, looks a bit bloody there. I think he had some uppercuts. He's bleeding from the nose a little bit. Bleeding from the nose and the mouth. Um, that was a good fight. Kirk and Steve feeling very good that they won this fight right here. Let's give it up for these two warriors finishing that round strong, ladies and gentlemen. Coach, I'm with you. I had it one round of peace going into the third, but I think, I think Mohammed probably got that third. Yeah, I think, yeah, that was a, an interesting fight, definitely. There was some, a lot of hands being thrown in that, that third round. There was some stiff left hands being thrown by Mo. Times where he doubled it. Yeah. He would go left, and it's like he would fade and throw it again. It's like he knew it would hit. I know we've got a lot of fights to go, but so far for fight of the night, this Ladies is the one that's. The judges have reached the decision. I think Ray got something in his eye. Like he's judges, he's, he was one, and three, so it's about 28 to 29. And judge number two, for split decision. To 28 for your winner. Nice split decision. Out of the blue corner, Mohamed Al-Fansi. Yeah, split decision win. That was a good fight.